Okay, guys, I'm going to show you how to do the Aaron Susskind um, styled photo, photo collage on um, Procreate. I want you to come first and get a, um, let's do a square. And we're going to, you should have taken like 16 photos of things around school. I want you to do the first one all in black and white in Aaron Siskind's fashion. So if you didn't change them to black and white on your phone, you can change them to black and white here. So I'm just going to use images that I already have on my, um, that I already have on my camera roll. So I'm going to go hit the wrench and put insert a photo i'm gonna take something i have here i'm gonna look for something i can maybe make a little abstract i'm gonna take these i went to a shoe store and those are a bunch of jordans i'm gonna go up here i have gallery wrench wand selection tool i'm gonna select um a square here i'm gonna hit rectangle here um uh, yep yeah, yep yeah. and then i'm gonna so I'm going to go back. I just got a little ahead of myself. Okay. And I'm going to hit selection tool, and I'm going to just select part of this so it's a little abstract. Then I'm going to hit invert. I'm going to swipe down on my screen with three fingers and hit cut. There I have um, a square. I can always change the size of that later. And I'm going to make it a little smaller. I'm going to try to fit 16 of those squares on here. So I'm going to come here, thinking about four across and four down. And we're going to come to the little wand, hit this, and hit saturation. And it's black and white. Okay, then I'm going to go to insert a photo. I'm going to take this. I'm just going to take that spaceship house. I'm going to take this graffiti wall that I went to and I'm going to hit my selection tool I'm going to hit a square again I'm going to hit invert take my three fingers swipe down hit cut and I am going to I'm going to put it on top of this right now to make sure it's pretty much the same size I can always go to free form if it's not an exact square size as my other one and make it a little bit different now i'm going to put it right next to here um and i'm going to go to the wand hit saturation and bring it down now i have two of my um squares like i said and i'd like to do 14. if you want you could put a little space between them i think i might do a little bit of space between them Okay, and I'm going to make this a little small. Oops, I'm going to go to uniform. Make that a little smaller. Okay, I'm going to continue doing that with 16 photos that you have taken. Like I said, you can take some around school. You can take them at home. You can get them from rolls. I'd like them to be from photos you took, though. So I'm going to insert a photo. Let's just put this one on there. I kind of like that one. As is, if I can make it a square. Put a lot of this in here. It doesn't just have to be a part of one. I could always just make it smaller. I'm going to hit invert, swipe with three fingers down, hit cut, make it about the same size. If it's not the exact same size, I'm going to go to free form. Move it on over. And then I'm going to hit... Um, saturation brightness saturation I kind of want to make that one a little brighter so it fits the vibe of the other ones okay now it looks like it's a little too big for my um, canvas so I can always come over here I'm going to swipe these layers together pinch them together and then I'm going to take my arrow here move it on over a little bit can I move that? There we go. And then I'll make it a little, oops, not that, free form. Nope, I want uniform. I'll come here and go back. There we go. Here. And I think I can get one more in there. I'm going to do that. And then, oh, golly. 
So my pen might be stuck a little bit. I'm gonna hit insert a photo. Like I said, you can always get part of one. These are just some weird things I have. I do have a funny photo that I guess we can do on that. It's a little too. Maybe I'll take this part back here. I'm gonna go to my selection. Invert, swipe with three fingers down, hit cut. All right, I like it. Continue going on with um, 16 photos. When you're done, like I said, you can always swipe the layers together and make this a little more. There we go, that looks good. And then I can follow that grid. All right, have fun.